This is a research grade inverted microscope which we use to visualize fluorescently labeled biological specimens. To it, I've added a home-built customized optical tweezer system, also known as an optical trap. We use opt an optical trap is similar in concept to a tractor beam that you find on spaceships and sci-fi movies. We use light to physically pick up and maneuver objects, except instead of very large objects, we do very small objects. In particular, we use this trap to position very tiny microbeads which we adhere to biological membranes. When we pull the two apart, it forms a very thin tubule. This is important because when we use this optical trap to do this, we can actually measure how much force it takes to form that tube to shape the membrane from that flat configuration. Knowing this force is important because biological membranes, in terms of cells, have a whole range of different shapes. Think of the shapes you've seen, spheres, tubes, ruffled kinds of membranes. How cells are able to do that, what kinds of forces it takes to do that, uh, is an important question. And it, this shape has an important role to play in terms of signal transduction, lipid and protein trafficking. Over here, we can see a bead which is held in the optical trap. And on the right-hand side, we see the force being measured in real time. As I move the bead quickly across the uh, screen, we see that we're able to move the bead in space and also measure those changes in force coming at just from dragging the bead around. My name is Michael Heinrich. I'm a researcher in the B.S. Baumgart Chemistry Lab uh, in the Department of Chemistry.